All right, this time I'm gonna use uh, M player to preview our webcam. It'll look something like this um, once you're done, right? I mean, I used this in the past, but it was from another webcam, and I got a new one, so I, uh, you know, I'm gonna make this video here. Anyways, hello, that's me. Um, the reason why I want to do this because um, I think in the next video or something that we're gonna talk about the Xbox controller, and we're gonna set that up to uh, you know player games. Uh, retro games and emulators and stuff like that on our Linux machine Pretty much it. So this is how it looked like and uh, you don't actually have to put it in the corner here You can actually move it around too if you like so it's not stationary. All right Anyways, let me show you the code here. Let's get out of that Code pretty simple is uh, I want to use M player of course you could use um, What was the other one like uh, MPV or any of the M player forks uh, should be the same type of code but basically we're telling it to preview um, at a uh, was a resolution of 640 by 360 so this is one of the resolution that my webcam supports and the device is uh, video zero basically if you have more than one webcam it will be like video one two three or whatever and our FPS rate is 30 that's the max uh, I think my webcam can go and also this flag if you want to take screenshots um, so during like you know your preview you want to take a screenshot and you just hit the S key what was that one you take the, the S key and it'll take a screenshot pretty much that's it for that and you want to put it always on top because uh, if you have other windows open you know your preview window will be the first choice only and this geometry thing here is basically to put it in that corner uh, when you open it so that's all like that and the other one the difference between this one and this one is just that it has this extra flag word no borders so let me give you an example of that here no border uh, no border uh, basically you don't have a title bar or anything like that and it does look clean but the thing with this one is that if you switch uh, to a different workspace it'll disappear right and you can't have a right click option or anything like that in here to enable it to be visible on all workspaces so this one I probably would not recommend it if you're trying to do uh, you know multiple workspaces uh, where you can actually switch to a different one and it'll still be on top so let me show you what I mean here. Let's go back to the other one. Uh, this one here. Now this one will be on top like, like all the other ones. So let's say for example I open up a mouse pad, right? And if I was doing something on here and I try to cover this one up, I can't because it's always on top. Uh, the other thing is that if I was going to switch workspaces, you see it disappears, right? But now that you have your title bar, um, you can always do um, what's that? Always uh, on visible workspace, and basically what that means is that even if you switch workspaces, it will still be uh, visible, right? So that's the reason why you would want the title bar instead of no borders or whatever. Uh, if you don't want to do it always on top anymore, you can always do uh, what's that? Always below other windows or same as other windows, and then when you click on this, you see that it will take over, right? Anyways, that was it. Always on top again. Um, so that's it for the two options, really. It's not that much. Now, as far as getting your uh, resolution and stuff like that, let me show you here. Let's close this back off here. So in here, we had a resolution of 640 by 360, and that's what my webcam supports. Um, depending on your computer, you know, you might you might want to go lower. Like if you have like a shitty graphic card or CPU or something, or your whole computer sucks, then you probably want to go lower resolution or something like that, or whatever purpose you're trying to do, you can actually lower it or higher it, depending on what you do. All right, but how do you get your um, what is that? Your resolution and everything that. Uh, you can see that this is my device here. Let me show you here. So my device is uh, what is that? A Logitech. Uh, C920 webcam here right and right now it's, it's on uh, video zero like I said before and if you want to get the available resolution you just run um, this other command here right you run this sucker and you see that this is all the resolution it supports so it does go up to uh, 
or the 1080p if I, I needed to but it lags if you know if I'm doing a screencast and, and having that high resolution also so that's why I have to lower it um, but these are all the other resolution that it supports and you can see that it has uh, different uh, FPS rates so you can do 30 24 and so on and so forth uh, right here anyways that's how you figure out the resolution of your webcam and, and uh, all that if you need to uh, from the command line of course anyways I'll post you the code and everything if you want to do a preview um, let's post that out open again a preview like this sucker right and if you want to take a screenshot like I said let's take a screenshot of uh, let me hold up something here this thing here let's see you focus and I all you gotta do is um, take my mouse here oops fuck <laughs> mess that up uh, take my mouse here and click on this stupid thing zoom it in first okay autofocus I just hit the S hotkey and that's it now I can stop this one and I think we have a screenshot there you go so this is our screenshot so if I do uh, open the screenshot here right that's the screenshot we just took by hitting the S hotkey uh, when we have it open anyways that's it for taking screenshots having a little preview so on and so forth, finding your resolution, that'd be for this one.